All right, what's going on, family? I pray everybody is still doing well as we off top. Give the most high y'all all the honor, the glory, and all praise and worship. This video right here is actually pre-recorded, so which means it's already done. So it's a premiere. Um, I've done it two days ago, but it looks live because I got a premiere and the comment section is live. So I want to let you know off top, the comments are live, but not me. Um, when you look at the 2024 eclipse that's supposed to happen on April the 8th, um, I'm in Dallas, Texas, okay? Born and raised in Dallas, Texas. And these are just my little thoughts on this um, video response back to you, Sister Carla. I pray because I know from where I stay, let me tell you something about Dallas. Our traffic is already horrible. Whether you're going north, south, east, or west. So this eclipse is going to have probably 500,000 people or more. Maybe even three quarters of a million or even a million. Because people will drive all over and will drive all over and have drove all over to see eclipse. And a lot of people are going to come straight to Texas too um, especially when you want to talk about Mexico or, or Texas being a little bit closer and seeing more of it you know that's why a lot of people say well that's why we're coming here but I pray hard because this could be a whole lot of road rage yeah I know where I'm going with this some folks have already told me their jobs out east, they shutting them down. They're not going to make no money on May the 8th. I mean, excuse me, April the 8th, which is, you know, coming up pretty soon. And the road rage, the traffic, man, that's going to cause a huge, huge backup in traffic. Uh, and you got so many crazy drivers. We already got a lot of crazy drivers here, and I'm not talking bad about nobody. I'm just looking at the facts and speaking what's real about all this um, traffic and, and, and coming just to see the eclipse happen. Now, I always have a question. What if you do all that traveling and it don't even happen on that day? Hmm. How bad would you feel then? I'm not predicting that. And I'm not saying it's not going to happen. It's just a thought in my mind. I see people be driving hours and hours. When I'm coming to Dallas, Texas, man, I'm coming to Texas. And then what if it don't even happen? Some of them done took off work. Um, but, yeah, they, done, they closing schools down already. Um, some jobs, some businesses are closed because they already know they're not going to be able to function right because of all the traffic that's here. That's why I say I pray hard that don't don't nobody get in road rage. Don't nobody get killed. Man, um, what else? I pray because people be texting and driving. Some going to be trying to take pictures while they behind the wheel. I mean, there's so many things that can go wrong with this just to see the S-O-N. I mean, excuse me. Y'all caught that. Just to see the S-U-N. And, and, and cross over the moon, as some may say. Now, it may last 30 minutes to an hour, you know, or it may be shorter than that. But when you realize what we, you got people out here that we call storm chasers. So some people just love this, man. And, and I'm not knocking what you do. Once again, it's not a hate message. You got storm chasers and then you got eclipse chasers, I like to call them. They're going to ride. They're going to drive. Um, They're excited. You know, but I pray once again for the safety because when you're not paying attention when you're driving or even if you don't, you know, you're slowing down a little bit or you looking and I pray don't nobody get run, run over on foot. I'm saying all of this, um, but it could be a whole lot of car wrecks behind this. And look, look at. Look at the problem we have in Dallas, Texas already. We are already, man, we we got so many 
people here now, and I'm not I'm not knocking what people do. Hey, you got to move, you got to move. But my point is, we got so many freeways here. What are you talking about? One eighty three, thirty, twenty, spur four hundred eight, loop twelve. I mean, we got a one fourteen. 35 North, 35 South, 635 East, 635 West, 635 North, 635 South. I mean, 80. We have so many freeways, and they've been building and building. What my point is, we are already congested. Traffic jams. Look at how many traffic jams are going to happen. So once again, and, and I got to throw this in there, look at how many people will be traveling with their guns in the car. That's why I say I pray, man, because with that road rage, road rage ain't no joke now. You got people just shooting up folks, man, because they, hey, you cut me off. So it's a lot that can go, go wrong with this because you just want to see the S-O-N, I mean the S-U-N, excuse me, cross over the moon, block the moon. So I pray for the safety. Some people I know are gonna have their children. Some people told me they, they already took off work. They planned for this long time ago. That's why I say, what if it don't happen? But what if it do? So I'm looking at the safety behind this. Um, and once again, my prayers are with everybody that's traveling, man. And and, and I just I can't stop talking about road rage enough because we have so much road rage here without. A eclipse. We have so much road rage and traffic jams. People getting out of their cars, man, running up to other people's windshields, knocking on their windshields, kicking on their door. We got enough of that here already without an eclipse. So you imagine if 500,000 people are here. That's what my wife was telling me. She said at the school, talking to the professor, the professors, they done already decided to call uh, to close Trinity Valley, which is out east in Terrell, Texas. You know, y'all that's in, in Dallas, Texas, or uh, you born and raised, so you know, or uh, if you just been in Texas a while, Dallas a while, you know what I'm talking about. When I say heading east, heading east, when you heading toward Terrell, 40, you know, um, some that's going to Kaufman. So y'all know, y'all know what time it is. So just be careful. And I'm I'm prayed up as always. But once again, my prayers, it don't turn into a violent thing and people get murdered, killed, shot up, road rage. And on that note, I love y'all and have a blessed day. Shalom.